Greetings and welcome to today's lesson. In today's lesson, we're going to review our phonograms. First time we go through, we'll do sound only. And um, you'll just say the sound only. Try to say it before I do. See if you get it right. Here we go. I. I. U. U. E. I. I. Or. Z, I, M, T, E, A, N, O, U, Q, R. All right, now this next time we'll go through, we'll do it again, we'll say the sound followed by the cue. Try to say it before I do, and if there's a rule, have it in your head so you can say it when I ask. Here we go. Er first. Qua. What always comes after a cue in English words? A U. U, U. Ung. A, not used. E. T. Mm. I. Sh, zh. When may I use this phonogram? When it follows an S in the base word, replaces an S in the base word, or it says zh. Two letters. X. What never comes after an X? S or Z? Or E, I, I. When do I use this? This will be the one I primarily use when I can't, uh, when I, I'm not going to use E, A, I. This is the primary one. Next one. O, U. Oh, I showed you that. <laughs> Sorry. Here we go. Ooh, uh. And the last one. I. I. All right. Uh, this time, <clears throat> we will uh, do our written phonogram review. So this time, I'll say the sound. You will say the sound and write it. Um, I will write it in manuscript, first and second, cursive for third. All right. Um, <clears throat> if you get it wrong, um, write it without looking. If you get it wrong, that's okay. Then just write, um, uh, put a line through it and write it correctly to the side. All right, here we go. First one, A, not used. A, not used. Next one, O, U. O, U. Next one, I, I. Next one, next one, I, I, I. Next one. Next one, er, first. Er, first. Next one, o, uh. O, uh. Next one, e, i, i. E, i, i. Next one, ung, ung. Next one, or, 
or next one. Next one, two letters, two letters. Next one, sh, zh, sh, zh. Next one, mm, mm. Next one. And the last one, E, E. All right, so just glance through those again. Make sure you got all of those right. If you didn't, just put a line through it so you know which ones to spend more time studying. That's all for today. I hope you have a wonderful day and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.